If you've been thinking about moving to Brantford and you're not entirely sure which community is right for you and your family, you're going to want to stick around because I'm going to go through another neighborhood here in Brantford. And this time it is the Murderville Mayfair area. Now this area is in the northwest corner of Brantford. So what we're going to do is we're going to tell you everything you need to know about moving into this community. And then we're going to go through and do a little bit of a drive through so you can see exactly what this neighborhood is like and to see if it's a perfect fit for you and your family. Before we get to it, if I can get you to hit that like button, subscribe and that notification bell so you can help other people just like you find this video. If you've been thinking about moving to Brantford, then you need to reach out to us because we help people just like you move to the city and move in and around the city every single day. And we absolutely love it. So reach out to us, give us a call, shoot us an email, send us a text, do whatever you can. We've got your back. So whether or not you're moving in a week, a month or a year, get in touch with us so we can help you make a smooth move to Brantford. So let's get after it right now. So today we are here in the Murderville Mayfair community and more specifically, we are in Deer Park. And this is just one of many parks that are littered throughout this community. So you're never very far from being able to take your kids out to play on a nice day. But this area is in the northwest portion of Brantford and it is highly sought after by commuters because of its close proximity to the 403, which you can then take west to Woodstock and London, or you could take east to Hamilton and Toronto. But you are also close to Highway 24, which will then allow you to get up to the Kitchener, Cambridge and Waterloo area. So this area is perfect for commuters. Now, when it comes to schools in this community, there are two elementary schools. You have Russell Reed Elementary, and then you have Our Lady Providence. So there are a couple options for you to send your kids to school in this community. One of the reasons why this area is so sought after is because of its close proximity to everything that you're gonna need when it comes to shopping and living in this community. You have a Walmart, you have a Cineplex Odeon, you have the banks, you have a Zares along with all the shops all along King George. So you're never very far from being close to things that you need to live in this community. Now, when it comes to the bus route that services this community, it is bus route number eight. It goes through the Mayfair area, down through Henderson, Homedale, all the way into the downtown core where the central station is where Laurier University is and Conestoga College is. And then from there, you're able to take buses in and out the rest of the city. Some of the things you're gonna to wanna to check out in this community is the Wayne Gretzky Golf Course. And it does take up a majority of this neighborhood. It is quite something that you're going to need to see. So if you are a golfer that loves to golf and wants to be able to get out onto the course, in a moment's notice, this might be the perfect community for you. You also have the Murderville House Museum, and this is a historic museum that you can go check out. There are rumors that this place is haunted, and to be honest with you, I did feel some presences when I was going to shoot the B-roll for this video, but I'll leave that up to you to check out and to figure out if it's real. Now, when it comes to real estate prices over the last six months, the average real estate price in this community was 794,643. Now there is a range of properties all the way from 605,000 all the way up to $1.4 million in this community. The typical lot size is 50 by a hundred. And there are some lots that are larger, but this is the typical lot size for this community. Now, the age of the homes in this community can range quite fairly, and it is they are either built in the 60s to 70s, the 80s to the 90s, or even within the last 20 years. So there are a lot of options for you to choose from in this community to find the perfect home for you and your family. A lot of homes in this community have pools in their backyard. So if having a pool is something that you are considering to have at your house, you're going to want to consider this neighborhood. When it comes to the future development of this community, the Brantford Economic Department does have future plans to build a new community. And that is the power line, 
West community and is going to be just north of Power Line Road. So there is still plenty of potential for this neighborhood to grow in the future. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take a quick drive through this neighborhood so you can see exactly what it's like if you move into this neighborhood and to see if it's the perfect fit for you and your family. If you like this video, you're gonna to wanna to check out this video right here where I go through another neighborhood here in Brantford. So I'll see you in the next video.